Welcome to the Wild and Scenic Film Festival Barn Concessions Volunteer Training. As a Barn Concessions Volunteer, you help create the magic of the Wild and Scenic Film Festival, where nature's beauty takes center stage and inspires change. Start of shift checklist. Upon arrival at the venue, check in with your venue captain by telling them your name and the role you signed up for. Once you're checked in, they'll hand you your volunteer badge. This is to be returned before you end your shift. During your shift, you'll work with a concessions lead staff member. They'll be your number one resource for getting started, finding supplies, and answering questions. Start of shift checklist continued. During your shift, you'll work with an iPad or tablet with a Square app, our payment processor, preloaded on the device. Please verify that it's logged in and ready, as well as synced to the Square Reader. For more information about Square device syncing, please see the instructions included in your Bar and Concessions Handbook. Available digitally now, printed versions can also be found in your Concession Lead Binder. Locate the Square Card Reader. Be sure it's charged as soon as you get to the table or bar. Locate the price list to be clearly displayed on the table or bar. If needed, Help with a quick check on concessions inventory. Only put a few of each item at most on the bar or table. Let your concessions lead know if any items need to be restocked or contact inventory and distribution coordinator Tara Moran for any restock needs, including food, drink, or hard goods like pint cups and restock ice into coolers as necessary. Restock canned or bottled beverages into coolers or refrigerators early in the shift so that they will be cooled for customers. Restock bottles of white wine into the coolers as well. Brew fresh coffee. More information on brew instructions in the Bar and Concessions Handbook in the Concessions Lead Binder. Morning and afternoon crew should get coffee brewing early to get ahead and fill up the air pots. Please be sure to preheat hot water so that the coffee stays hot. Pre-boil water so that there's less time needed to make a cup of tea. Taking an order. Greet the patron and ask them how you can help them. Take their order, entering each item requested into the Square app via the iPad or tablet. If alcohol is being ordered, you must follow alcohol service rules. See the following slides. Call out the order as you enter it into uh, the Square app so that concession staff who are pouring drinks or gathering food can hear you, but not too loud if the films are screening. If you're the only one currently on concessions, wait until payment is complete to gather their items. Taking an order continued. Provide the customer with the total amount due. Take the customer's payment via Square. Even if it's cash, please record and enter the item information and cash payment amount via Square. And then provide the customer with any change and their order only once payment has successfully been completed. Get ready to greet the next patron and restock supplies as needed. During your shift, there might be between one to three other people working with or near you behind the bar. The concessions lead or venue captain will always be the first person to check in with you about how duties will be divided during the shift. Comfortable with payment processing and customer service? You might be working with Square. Have a great pour for beverages and quick scoopability skills for popcorn? You might be assigned to gather customer items. Thanks for jumping in where you're most needed. Now, let's go over a sample sale via the Square app on a tablet similar to the one that you'll use during your shift. Here you can see that we've opened the Square app and we're in the Library tab. There's Keypad, Library, and Favorites, which offer you an array of options that you can navigate to different items in the app. When you click Favorites, you'll see CO, a logo that navigates you right to all of the concessions items. That's a quick at-a-glance way to reach any concessions items. If you go back to the library button, you'll see there's also another concessions menu there. You can use the search function to find popcorn or any other items that your patrons might be ordering. So to add an item, just click on it and it will immediately go into the cart. You can also hold down on an item to adjust the quantity. And this is the final menu you'll see they've ordered some popcorn, some larges and smalls. Oh, but actually they changed their mind midway through the order and they'd only like one instead of four. So we just edited that by holding it down. And now they're ready to pay. So 
You can see all of our different payment options here. For the most part, we'd love to take cards, but cash and paying with a QR code to, to pay with Apple Pay or Google Pay is also an option. Let's say that they give us a $20 bill. It'll tell us $10 change out of 20 that we owe them, and then they wouldn't like a receipt, so we can just press no thanks and go to new sale. All right, you can see here that we also have the ability to refund a transaction or edit a transaction in case um, may, a big mistake occurred. So you could issue a refund. Um, you know, maybe maybe they just in or and canceled their order entirely. In which case, you could press canceled order and then refund, and it would go back to their card. Or, you know, maybe maybe there wasn't a card exchange; it was just cash, and they took that back. You could go back in and you know, unrecord the transaction as it didn't go through. This happens very rarely, and we don't typically offer refunds unless absolutely necessary. All right, and you can see here, we're starting our new sale with a new person, and on we go. Alcohol service rules. All persons serving or otherwise dispensing alcoholic beverages must be at least 21 years of age. There shall be no self-service. All persons serving or dispensing alcoholic beverages are hereby prohibited from consuming any alcoholic beverages during the time that alcoholic beverages are sold, served, or dispensed. All purchasers of alcohol are required to have the appropriate wristband to identify them of age. If the purchaser doesn't have a wristband yet, it's your responsibility to ID that patron. Today's wristband should have the date... Um, with no later than 2003. For instance, February 15th, 2003 is, is the l earliest date that we can accept. Alcohol service rules. All alcoholic beverages will be sold and served in containers which shall be distinctive in design and color and easily distinguishable from any other containers used in the service of non-alcoholic beverages. All alcoholic beverages shall be served in official WSFF cups. Non-alcoholic beverages are served in their own respective containers, cans, bottles, etc. No person shall be served more than two containers of any alcoholic beverage at any one time per visit at the bar. No alcoholic beverages shall be allowed to be brought onto the licensed area by public or, or invited guests, nor shall alcoholic beverages be allowed to be removed from the licensed area by the public. End of shift checklist. Check the battery status of devices. Place on the charger as needed, if not the last shift of the day. If you're working on the final shift, return the iPad to your venue captain at the end of the day. Leave concessions clean and orderly and ready for the next shift to take over. No garbage laying around, wipe up counters and other surfaces, etc. If you are handling the cash box, directly hand the cash box to the venue captain or concessions lead for them to count, and then they will pass that on to the next shift when they arrive. Do a quick check on concessions inventory and alert your concessions lead of any restock needs, or reach out to our inventory and distribution coordinator, Tara Moran. End of shift checklist continued. Check out of your shift by handing your volunteer badge back to your venue captain, and in return, they'll hand you your volunteer perk ticket code, which can be redeemed online at wsff.eventive.org for a free film session. You've now completed the pre-festival bar and concessions volunteer training for the Wild and Scenic Film Festival. Thanks so much for joining us and helping create the magic of this year's Film Fest. If you have any questions that should be answered pre-festival, please feel free to call the Circle Office at 530-265-5961. Any other questions will be answered by your venue captain upon arrival at the venue. We can't wait to see you soon!